The earth is an absolutely immense place, yet it is so insignificant in the grand scheme of things. The small mud ball we live on is orbiting an average star that is located in an average location of a galaxy that has 100,000 million stars. Yet this galaxy is just one of many in our supercluster, and this supercluster is one of millions in the observable universe. And the universe itself could be billions of times larger, but it gets even more mind-bogglingly large. This universe may be solely one of potentially infinite universes. This would be the multiverse. So what is a multiverse? Well, there are three primary models of the multiverse that have been proposed by physicists. One of these three primary models suggests extra dimensions in addition to membranes. Numerous string theorists provide the hypothesis that what we perceive as our universe is simply a three-dimensional surface or membrane that is within a true universe which consists of nine dimensions unimaginable to the human brain. This would mean furthermore that there are countless other membranes which are perceived as universes to those who live inside them, but are actually a component of the true super universe. This is somewhat like the pages of a book, which are two-dimensional membranes being embedded in this three-dimensional world. Bubble universes are the secondary types of parallel universes, and are the most basic and least complex theory out there about the topic. These bubbles would either be extremely far away or in black holes, meaning we would never access them. Each of these bubbles circulating throughout the vast universe would have unique principles and laws of physics with different fundamental tendencies. This bubble would be the sole location in the universe where all the phenomena we know could occur since it has suitable laws of physics. All the other bubbles would have unfathomable occurrences within them. It's hard to imagine what would go on in these, because we do know that without these specific laws of physics, many essential things like atoms couldn't form. These universes would most likely be beyond our imagination with such different building blocks and principles. If two bubble universes were to collide, then perhaps they would form a new universe with wholly new laws of physics, and what we would perceive as the Big Bang could, in fact, be the collision of these two universes. Lastly, we have the many worlds interpretation, where we live in one timeline of an infinite series of parallel universes. The many worlds theory proposes the idea that there are countless alternate timelines for the universe and every possible chain of events happen in an ever-branching manner. Literally everything possible, ever, would happen in at least one timeline, according to this theory. If this were true, we wouldn't know because of the fact that we would solely be living in one of the potentially infinite timelines in existence. Certain timelines would have a doppelganger of you, and many may not have one. Worst of all, some would have no dig deeper. It may even be possible that these models could all be combined into a super complex multiverse, with many membranes containing bubbles and infinite possibilities of what occurs in the universe. So next time you get frustrated at a small, insignificant thing in life, just take a step back and appreciate the vast scale of the universe and the fact that there may even be an infinite amount of them. Thanks so much for watching and if you enjoyed be sure to like, subscribe and comment down below. Which multiverse theory do you think is the most interesting and believable? Vote in the poll above. If you enjoy our content be sure to follow our Instagram at Dig Deeper Science, our Facebook also at Dig Deeper Science, and lastly our Twitter at DigDeeper14. And of course, always dig deeper.